Here's his, see Rivers making his way to the rim. Austin Rivers now with his sixth NBA team got into the Rockets organization last December. I don't think it's that Kevin McHale didn't buy into what they were doing. I just been and Philly. Well, and Gianluca was with Gerson Rosas down, down in its Rio Grande Valley, too. Timberwolves turning defense into offense. It's off the Pacers 111-102. It, it took some shots just like that down the stretch from, from James Harden to get them over the top. As Towns get that one's the nestle in. Indiana. <laughs> Indiana. This team into the bonus early. Harden dumps it off. Harden's team. And the Timberwolves come up with it. Oh, man. Teague gets his pocket picked. McLemore pulls up to the three-point line. I think Ben McLemore has really embraced this Houston Rockets system, hasn't he? <laughs> I mean, you mentioned all the three-point shots. It is, what, 90% of his shots have been from outside the arc. Teague looking for a three. Can't get it to fall. Well, if you're not... Teague, oh wow, what able to able to find Lehman back there, who was signed as an undrafted free agent by the Rockets. Lehman hurries it up the floor the other way. Graham trying to battle. Wow, does what come an down with it. A rebound. Sure was. Teague for three. And you got to be physical with him. And Harden giving James Williams an earful. It was James who very authoritatively blew the whistle. Teague, no, and we'll get a loose ball foul here. Had to do so much for their team offensively. Great two-way player, and he realizes it too. Oh my goodness. Timberwolves flirting with a turnover, and Clemens comes out of there with it. And Clemens able to finish. Jeff Teague threw that pocket pass, and Noah Vuk Good job handling the basketball by Jared Culver as Jake Lehman can't get that to go. Nice offensive rebound, though, by Noah Vonley. Covington able to get a difficult shot to go in traffic. Now you with his statistics. But I'll tell you what, he's he's one of those guys that makes you into a championship level team. But you and didn't you didn't even mention his best ability as Carl Anthony Towns drills the three. In fact, the Rockets as a team have only attempted three free throws. The Timberwolves have attempted nine. Houston on average averages nine and a half points per game from the unbelievable. Also a pretty good three point shooter. So there are some guys when you switch, you go, the okay, kid's a mismatch, but it really isn't. Wow, that's a friendly bounce. He matched his career high for scoring in a game with 16. This, this is the, the Mo Wagner of tonight's game. Teague looking to dump it off for Covington. Knocked out of bounds, and it'll be Rockets ball. Houston, a chance to tie it or go back in front. You Jeff, see Russell Westbrook leading the cheers over there on the Rockets bench. Jeff Teague has had a sloppy game tonight. Harden gets fouled from behind. He came into tonight's game having scored 464 points in 442 minutes on the season. And tonight he's got 30 points in 18 minutes, so he's continuing to take that. Last night in terms of uh, the all-time uh, scoring numbers, they're right there at the same pace as P.J. Tucker uh, gets that to go more second chance points for Houston. Just a killer. Teague gets across mid-court. Shot clock already down to four. Teague attacking Tyson Chandler. Wow, great stop right. to get Chandler to go by. Minnesota really trying for the follow, can't get it. The Timberwolves get the rebound. The Wolves are winning on the glass, which is a big indicator of their success. They're unbeaten this year. When they win the glass battles, Towns. What's the time to shoot a three? Because a lot of times, you know, you got guys running out. You got uh, the floor is, is, is a broken floor situation as Jake Lamey gets that one to go. He's been fantastic when his shoulders have been squared. Tim Rolls looking to build a little bit of a lead. Trailed by two at the half. Teague for Travion Graham. Needs to see one fall, and he gets a roll. <laughs> Travion Graham, Jim, came into the league as a fairly decent three-point shooter, but it was a career low last year in Brooklyn, and the number's been even more down this year. Ryan Saunders says he thinks it'll come. He's too good of a shooter for it not to come, and you hope maybe a roll like that might start it for him. Harden, meantime, has been awfully good for quite a while. Towns inside. Just having, you know, 
bigs in post-up situations, and I miss the, the, the big players, you know, doing their thing. Layman. I love it when it works up. And a half second difference between the clocks here, so the Timberwolves cannot wind it all the way down. This Rockets lead is their largest of the game. And Lehman gets three back for Minnesota. Now thinking September. So a late addition to the roster. And Tabo unable to connect on the shot attempt. Cephalosian now with his fifth NBA team. He was a valuable player with the OKC Thunder. Nice feed, a good cut by Culver. Culver, but they've turned it over on three consecutive trips, have the Timberwolves. Rivers loses the basketball right into the hands of Tucker. Shot clock easy. Deflection, Jeff Teague's got an open look at the rack. Harden. Shot clock down to five. Harden drives in, gets the foul, and one. Teague. Got denied by Rivers, gets it out to Travion Graham. Graham one of five from outside the arc. It was all a buzz that Becky Hammond might be the first woman to take over an NBA team and coach the NBA team. First woman to really lead yeah. a team in any of the four she major...